Hello and welcome to jasonnewland.com My name's Jason Newland This is Relax and Sleep Hypnosis Daily This podcast used to be called Sleep Hypnosis Weekly So I've changed it So With the intention of making regular daily recordings please only listen when you can safely close your eyes I thought I'd do a body scan today I'm just going to go through different parts of your body and I read something or I saw something online which said that the Navy SEALs have a technique which enables them when they learn it to be able to fall asleep and relax deeply and fall asleep within a very short time when practiced. So I was I was interested in sort of looking into this. And I guess part of the technique was to be able to relax in some of the more stranger situations. Well, upon further research It's very much a case of doing a body scan, like a progressive relaxation by focusing on different body parts. And by doing this daily, your body and your mind starts to get used to the process. And also starts to expect to feel more relaxed. And in the case of falling asleep, expecting to drift into a deep healing sleep. Now there will be two versions of this recording, one with music, one without. The music one will be about two hours long. And this is both for relaxation and for sleeping. Because pretty much at least 95% of falling asleep is relaxing. The only way really to fall asleep without being relaxed, I guess, would be to to be completely exhausted, you know, to maybe have gone a long time without sleeping, which I wouldn't recommend, and to be physically exhausted. And I know that I've had that happen to me in the past, maybe you have too. You know, in the past, I'd have maybe, when I used to work in a bakery, I'd be working, doing 16-hour shifts. I'd get home, I'd get into bed, and the next thing I knew, I'd woken up by the alarm, the alarm clock for the next day shift. But I don't have that kind of day anymore, I don't do uh, 16 hours working in a really physically demanding environment, so I'm not going to bed completely exhausted. I mean, there's some benefits to it, I guess, you know, 
physically, I suppose it was good for me. But it's not the reality for me. And it's probably not the reality for a lot of people listening now. Because there's also the process of wanting to, needing to relax. Wanting to relax, needing to relax. But back then I didn't, I didn't know about relaxing. I just, I just assumed that being stressed and uptight was how I was and that was it. However, there's always been a contradiction there as well because I've always had a slow pulse. So I tend to be able to relax fairly easily once I do stop, once I take a break. Physically, but not always mentally. So I had to learn to calm my mind. And a lot of that was done through meditation, also through hypnosis and other techniques like the body scan and imagination. Also about 22 years ago, I started listening to a relaxing recording. It was a relaxation slash sleep CD that I got. And I listened to it every day. And it was so useful for me. It really, really helped. And I think that that laid a little egg, you know, a little seed for me to perhaps want to do something like that myself in the future. And then a few years later, I started doing that myself. So I do understand the benefit of listening to another person just talking. And sometimes it doesn't even necessarily matter so much what is being said as so much as how it's being said. To the extent of You could listen to me talking about a book that I'd recently read and I could be talking about that. And you could start to notice that you are feeling more relaxed. Even though I've not purposely focused your mind upon that sense of physical comfort that is growing within you throughout your body and your mind starts to slow down and that could be almost in recognition of I guess my speech not being particularly fast and things just generally feel calmer just by listening to my voice you give yourself a, an opportunity to take a break from the day. Take a break from your life as it is. And to give yourself a rest. Giving yourself permission 
to take some time off and to allow your body to relax and allow your mind to slow down which in turn releases the tension any stresses that you had in your body it's almost as if the parts of your body just open up allowing the negativity out and at the same time replacing that negativity with positive healing energy which then fills your body up and your mind to also starts to appreciate those feelings of increasing confidence and an almost uplifting feeling a positive healing an energy that spreads through your body like a wave of comfort and all this comes from just allowing yourself a few minutes maybe half an hour however long you want it to be to just rest and allow your mind and your body to almost reset itself to the, to the settings of comfort and relaxation calmness which allows more room for feelings of pleasure and happiness to move around your body and into your mind almost as if your mind and your body are sinking together almost mirroring each other with that growing positivity and calmness and it feels nice it really does feel nice to know that you are the one that has allowed yourself to feel more comfort and to experience more of this deep relaxation spreading throughout your body and as I focus on each part of your body you can notice that that part becomes even more relaxed just by focusing on it, it becomes even more calm and comfortable just by focusing and as I move down your body starting at your head 
parts that you've already focused on will continue to relax deeply. And those parts that we've not yet focused on will just automatically release any remaining tension in anticipation of even more comfort about to come. Now, and start by focusing on your forehead. Just being aware of the feelings of your forehead. And any background sounds like Mr. Herbert the Pigeon can just allow you to feel even more relaxed. Just means you're in the moment. This isn't this isn't a sterile environment. This is the world. I live in the countryside, so there's lots of nature sounds around. So as you focus on your forehead. Just notice how it becomes even more relaxed as you focus only on my voice and that part of your body. Moving down to your eyes, focusing on your eyes, noticing how the, your eyelids feel so heavy, yet so light at the same time. And all the muscles around your eyes relaxing completely. Moving your focus down to your mouth your lips, your tongue, your teeth and your gums, and the whole of your mouth relaxing, calm and loose as you focus now on your jaw, not just part of your jaw near your mouth, or your chin, but all the way up the sides of your face to your ears, that whole of your jaw, feeling more relaxed. in on your neck, the front of your neck and your throat, relaxing and loose and calm, the sides of your neck, the right and left side of your neck. Relaxed and loose and calm. And now the back of your neck. Focus in on the back of your neck. Letting go of any tension that may have been there before and enjoying that sense of in 
increasing comfort and release that you can experience in the back of your neck. Moving down your back, moving either side of your spine, right from the top of your back, all the way down to the bottom of your back. Down to your lower back. As you move up and down your spine, you can feel the muscles either side of your spine relaxing even more. And as those muscles relax, that sense of comfort starts to spread outwards from your spine into both sides of your back. The top of your back, the middle and your lower back. And as you scan gently and slowly up and down your back as the muscles in the top of your back relax and become looser. The muscles in the middle of your back also seem to just almost divide from each other, separating and almost melting. And in your lower back, there seems to be an extra special feeling of comfort. that spreads into your hips so down your lower back and into your hips, into the area where your coccyx are, and into your buttocks. And all those muscles that spread from your lower back into your hip area. Start to melt. Start to really let go. And even though we're about to focus on your shoulders, your back and your spine will continue to let go, continue to relax, so calmly, as you focus on your shoulders, you may notice that they're already feeling really loose. They're already feeling calm. And they're feeling that those muscles that move from your neck into your shoulders. Feels 
so soft and gentle, so smooth. and calm. And the feeling in your shoulders seems to spread deep into your shoulders that sense of relaxation, not just traveling deeply into your muscles, but also relaxing the bones, and moving all the way to underneath your arms. Relaxing that whole area between the tops of your shoulders and underneath your arms. Healing. You feel so relaxed and comfortable in your shoulders. which sends that deep healing message into your arms. And you may feel almost as if your arms are not even there because they're so relaxed, so deeply relaxed. So spreading all the way down your arms to your elbows including your elbows circumference spread all the way into your wrists, your forearms and your wrists, feeling so heavy, yet at the same time, so light and gentle, Focusing now on 
is a sense of real peace. just seems to feel so familiar when your hands relax deeply. fingertips attention to the front of your body, so comfortable. muscles in your thighs your knees so
muscles and your shins completely Letting 